everyone, this is OMG Rome. A uh, very, very short video here for you just to show you uh, Minecraft Realms. A lot of you have probably already seen them before, um, but I recently decided to get one for myself and see what it's like. I'll be perfectly honest, it's pretty good, it's not too bad. So let's go in and let's have a quick look at it. <laughs> what is Realms? <laughs> well, hopefully, I'll be able to answer that question today. Um, so this is mine. Uh, first of all, it says down the back, we've got Office of Play. Uh, leave by configure and back. I'm going to go into configure first. So in there, you'll see the people who are invited to come and play on mine. So these are friends of mine. You can turn it on and off up here. You can also view your player activity. Wait for this to load up. Or maybe it's oh, uh, here we go. So you can see there's me, and I've been on it quite a fair bit. I'm playing with Cali. Uh, let's have a quick look who's been on recently. So, uh, Brendan on for a while. Probably caught him on for a tiny patch. And then, uh, he can come off the list probably. I'll leave him alone for now. All right, so enough. So you can switch to mini games as well. Now I haven't gone through and looked at any of these, but I will be looking at doing a video on each of the mini games at some point in the future. Cake defense sounds quite funny. Um, and I imagine you just change that and go switch. Edit world. Now in here you can reset the world if you want to. You can upload one of your already existing worlds, or you can download the latest version of yours. And also in it there's hourly backups. I say hourly, it's sometimes one hour, two hours, depends on when it is. So if I download the latest, that'll take too long because I'm streaming. Let me go back. And also look at your world settings. So in here you can do your name of the realm, description for it. So I've just got survival mode. And then you go into more options and have a look at the settings. So at the moment you can see we've got PvP off. Uh, just because a few of the people who play on my server are quite noobish and accidentally punch each other. Um, that's all right. Animal spawns on. Monsters on or off. Command blocks on or off spawning NPCs on or off game mode, which you've got survival, creative, adventure. Your spawn protection. I'll be honest with you, I don't know what that does. Um, I imagine it might be how many seconds you get when you initially spawn before you can die again. Go back into here. So clicking on subscription will take you to some details as to when it started, how many days it's got, and how to extend the subscription. Obviously, going in here, you can invite new players. Now, this uh, essentially they're whitelist only, so you have to know somebody's Minecraft name in order to invite them onto the realm. And from here, you can also remove them from the list, and you can also give them OP powers. Um, essentially, commands that work. I'll show you when we go in there. Uh, basically, at the moment, me and my friend Cat, we've been constructing an, an outpost on this island. I'll give you a quick tour of this. Not much really to see. Because we're at, if you look up here, in the top left, we're at uh, 2707Z axis. Our normal Z axis is like 70 or 80. So we're trying to explore as much content as possible as we initially started building on one of the most boring locations on the server so going through here and building this I built a tunnel right the way through but from within here let me close down that there we go get back up here so server admins types of commands you get they're quite basic um but they're ones that you know that are going to start to become quite standardized to so type in help that'll bring up the first page so in here you've got it you can give players achievements uh you can clear their items i believe set default game mode so you can set it to adventure or creative or survival 
through the in-game as well, as well as setting the difficulty command. You can also give players effects, so give them enchantments, and set the game mode for that individual player. So game mode 1, for example, puts on creative for you. Game mode 0 goes back to survival. Help 2 to bring up the second admin page. And in here you can set up the game rules. So you can create rules for the games. You can also give players items, uh, do helps with command. So you could, let's have a look at this, help. Kill. It doesn't do anything. Help to doesn't really help you at anything. List, just a list of all the players. Help page three. So in here you've got play sounds. So you can play sounds as well. You can just say stuff in general, which I've never used. Test in one, two, three. Must just talk, I guess. You've got a scoreboard. You can bring up the seed for the world. So you can find the seed for your realm. Since you don't get to create one on startup. You can set the world spawn as well, as well as setting blocks. You can also. Ah, uh, I would have been on that one. You can also set the time, weather, and I'm not sure what downfall is, so let's have a look. Ah, rain. Maybe that's permanent rain, because they have got just a normal weather setting as well. But I can look at that at a later date. You can also just give players experience. Now you can give them set amounts of experience. So you can give them levels as well. So forward slash XP 1L. So just putting the letter L at the end. And then my in-game name. And you can see from the middle of the screen I've been given one level. All right, well, hopefully this has been a relatively informative realms one. Let's stick on... A Let's watch the sunrise. <laughs> Over the ocean. All right, enough of that. Uh, hopefully this has been you know, relatively informative for people who are not quite sure about the realms or what they do. Uh, they do appear to be country specific. So for example, my one that I'm in currently in New Zealand, I say currently because I'm not from New Zealand, as you can probably tell by the accent. Um, so mine is based here in New Zealand. Uh, I will be looking to swap it when I get back to my own country. Uh, hopefully I've helped. Take care, guys.